I'm Nick from AutoZam. I'm here with the lovely James from The Crowd Goes Wild. Good to be here. Cheers. Um, and uh, we're going to go through the basic chords for Why Does Love Do This To Me, a classic Jordan Luck song. And if you want to join in, feel free. So basically, the, the intro of the track, right, you've yeah. got, it's a big flourishy type thing. Close. Something like that. But, 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 but the thing is, he goes into what's like a, almost like a palm mute. So you've, oh, yeah. if you rest your hand kind of at the back, and it's just really softly down by where the, where the bridge is. Oh, yeah. And you just, it kind of mutes the strings compared to them being like that. Oh, yeah, okay. So you got... Got you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's try and get it right across, like almost kind of coming off the back. And easy chord. Go to try the D. <laughs> and and plucking from there. There down. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Just stay on that. the chords yeah okay and obviously you can't you can't do the whole, whole chord. chord you're not going sure so just, you from you can. just from the to the bottom root notes there so perfect uh, and from the a uh, yeah i wish me a little old thing eh? Yeah, just even if it's just the bottom couple, oh, which yeah. which is exactly why it's probably in some cases easier to play bar chord. Yeah. So a bar chord, you're moving a shape yeah. around the neck like that. Just the same thing. Then you've got power chords, yeah. which is just a, a lesser version of a bar chord, basically. So if you've got a D, a D, yeah. You got a D. So let's go up to the fifth fret, so up to here, and put up your first here. finger there oh, yeah. on the A string. Yeah. yeah. And your third finger there on the D. That one there? Yeah. Yeah. And you get used to because that will feel like a stretch possibly. Yeah. It just it will come get second nature. It. And so because it's because it's a smaller form of the chord, it's easier. Yeah. So the three shapes, perfect, oh, yeah. almost perfect. So, so go up to there. Yeah. And that finger on the D. Oh yeah, sure. So it's two. Yeah. And then move that same shape. Down to the third fret. Okay. But down the strings. Like so that. on the E there. Oh yeah. And the A there. Oh, and then yeah. move that shape up to there. Okay. And then your three chords. That's your D, G, and A. So like uh, that one there. Yeah. But it's probably with that. It's probably best still to kind of stick with just one shape, so you get used to it before you start. Oh, yeah, okay, so down to the fifth fret, which is there, we start with... How's the intro go? Well, I think that'll about do us, Nick. <laughs> yeah, that was good Good start. first lesson. Good start, yeah. And I'll uh, go away, practice that, and looking forward to the 24th of May down at Sky City. Absolutely. To uh, break the record, New Zealand Music Month. Yeah. Should be good. Absolutely. Done. Thank Done. you. Not a problem, bro. Awesome. Come on New Zealand, let's play. Register at nzguitarrecord.co.nz now. Thanks to Sky City and Juice TV.